so it's time for another garage video. I've made sort of a hole there, but I'm gonna fill it right back up here in a second. And I put a couple things away, but yeah, that didn't really make much of a dent. And I moved some junk around. But what I decided I wanna do tonight, because I worked on the stupid pool filter all day, is I wanna move this Monarch there. That Monarch there. Get it the hell out of my way the hell out of the center of the garage. So anyway, that means that all this junk's gotta move back up against the garage door and the plywood, which goes on that wall, has to move over here. So, let's do it to it. All right, so it's time for another garage video. I've made sort of a hole there, but I'm gonna fill it right back up here in a second. And I put a couple things away, but yeah, that didn't really make much of a dent. And I moved some junk around. But what I decided I wanna do tonight, because I worked on the stupid pool filter all day, is I wanna move this Monarch there. That Monarch there. Get it the hell out of my way the hell out of the center of the garage. So anyway, that means that all this junk's gotta move back up against the garage door and the plywood, which goes on that wall, has to move over here. So, let's do it to it. Okay, so those two things you watched me wrestle across the the floor. That's a 12 inch rotary table. I don't remember what I paid for it. It was a fair price. I want to say a couple hundred bucks. And I bought it from the guy I bought the mill from. Real nice, real, real nice machinist and engineer. And he gave me the tool post grinder that goes with this lathe. I have no idea what the hell I'll ever do with the tool post grinder. But having the one that goes with this lathe makes me really happy. And uh, we just don't make machines like this anymore. I'm not even sure if we can. I think we've lost the ability to make these kind of machines. Anyway, let's go back to time lapse. Okay, so you obviously see me looking around. I'm trying to find my bucket of tooling, which I thought was right here, but it's not. And I thought, well, maybe it was over with my welder. So I'm still looking for it, but I'm going to kind of clean up the garage as I go. And um, that's disturbing because there's a lot of tooling in that thing, and I don't know where it would have gone. I know where it better not have gone. It should still be here because everything else is. Anyway. I'll find it.
Wow, that's what I call a change. So, I got the lathe in its uh, installation point, and I got a bunch of junk shuffled around, a little bit of it reorganized. And in case you're wondering why I'm using a pallet jack to move this table, there is a steady rest and a 12 inch chuck and a mill vise under this table. And all that weighs just a little bit. So anyway, uh, I think that's it for tonight. I'm gonna turn the heat down. And uh, tomorrow I'm gonna work on this section of the wall and see if I can't wrap this corner of the garage. I don't have high hopes for that word, but we'll just see where we go. Being done is not one of my strong suits. You haven't figured that out by now.